I added Coke to the wet flour. This recipe is perfect for your coffee. In a container, start by adding 150 grams of wet flour, 1 teaspoon of sugar, 1 teaspoon of salt, 7 grams of organic yeast for bread. Mix everything very well. Then add 250 ml of coke and move again. As soon as the dough starts to get heavy, add 3 tablespoons of oil. Stir a little and then start mixing with your hands. When the dough is like this, move to a countertop and start to snare. So, for about 5 minutes until the dough is very fluffy and does not stick more to the fingers. Using the same container where we made the dough, grease with a little oil. Add the dough and cover with a plastic. Leave the dough resting for one hour. Here I left the dough resting in the oven off. After that time, remove the plastic and remove all air from the dough. With the dough like this, divide into six pieces. If you prefer and have at home, you can use a scale because it's more accurate. Go folding the dough inwards and then place on the countertop to start opening. Repeat the process like I'm doing in the video and roll the dough. The part left over, squeeze it with your fingers. Repeat the process with the rest of the dough and place one next to the other. Leave it to rest for another 20 minutes. After that time, stick the ends of the dough and then start braiding. It's very easy. Divide into three parts. You are going to throw the sides into the middle until you run out of the dough. If you can't do like this, do in the way it's best for you. An easier way or even another form of bread. But so too is perfect. So it's ready, now just take it and move on to a shape. Cover and let it rest for another 40 minutes. After this time, brush with an egg, or if you prefer, brush only with the yolk. Passing the egg all over the bread. Bake at 180 degrees and leave it to 30 for 40 minutes or until golden brown. And look how amazing this bread is! Sincerely, there's no way to resist. Do it at your home that I'm sure everyone will love. I hope you enjoy it. This was another little recipe from the poor in the kitchen. That strong hug, until the next time, and thanks for watching!